them. Yeah, on this hot day, the Roseville Fire Kids Camp begins, giving children the opportunity to explore a career in firefighting, and that includes some adults, too. Uh, at least one. Fox 40's Aton Wallace joins us live from the Roseville Fire Training uh -huh. Center to show us what the kids are learning, oh what he's learning. Ah. Ah, Aton, he's hanging off a building. I know, he's about to go down. Repel for us, Aton. Hey, hey, Sinceri and Melanie, good morning. It is great to be here at the Roseville Fire Kids Camp. And yes, we're five stories up here. This camp is all about teaching kids everything about firefighting, fire safety, and yes, even CPR first aid. Now, with me here, 12-year-old Lainey. And Lainey, how many times have you done this just today? Uh, three times. Three this times. Is my so this fourth. Your fourth time. Shall we? Shall we go? Yeah. All right. How? How you? What's your favorite part about this camp? I like the classrooms where you learn how to like keep people safe when they're choking and the babysitting part. Excellent. Excellent. Now, okay. So here we are repelling. What are some pointers that you have for me and for anybody who wants to do some repelling? Well, first of all, try not to go that fast. <laughs> That's great. Uh huh. Uh. Uh, and to hold on to the carabiners here, mm -hmm. and uh, when you want to like jump down, uh, we probably won't jump down though. Uh, you bring it out, okay. and you jump oh, down. Oh, look at that! How about we try just one? Is that okay? Yeah. Just like that. One more. Oh, look at that! All right. <laughs> How about one more? Oh. <laughs> okay, Melanie and Sincere, wow, this is a fun time here. Now, so you've really enjoyed the classroom, but you really like this too. This is your yeah. fourth time. So is it fair to say you're not afraid of heights? Kind of still. <laughs> but you're doing such a great job. You're a real pro. I got to ask you, after taking this camp, after doing this camp, which now has been going on for more than 20 years, are you inspired by yes. these firefighters? Yeah. What do you want to be when you grow up? Um, I either want to, maybe I might be a firefighter, or right. I might open my own uh, bakery called Chico Treats. All righty, uh, well, both are good. And meantime, we are almost down here. And what is your recommendation here? What do you mean? To just, <laughs> to just oh, look at you, to just land safely. All yeah. right, you did a great job. Thank you, you so too. much for coming with me. That, <laughs> It was a great time, and there you have it, Melanie and Sinceri. Let's give it up for Lainey. She did such a great job helping me all the way down. That was five stories. That was amazing. Really, really appreciate it. This is a six-day long camp, and we have 11 to 14-year-olds, not to mention 15 to 16-year-olds who've already done this, who get leadership experience to be kind of these uh, uh, counters in training. So they're helping out too, and we have, of course, the real deal firefighters. We had Paul and Eric up there helping me do this it was a lot of fun uh and it goes to show you what firefighters do with every single day and that is precisely the point of this camp to teach these kids just that amazing heroism they do every day even for a few seconds i think we just experienced that <laughs> reporting live here in roseville Aton wallace fox 40 news